good morning one and all and welcome to pankaj's echelon tutorials in this today's session we are going to deal with exercise 4 from algebra 1 chapter from the david renner book that is edition 4 uh, edition 4 yeah so david renner book ka solution we are doing and we have already completed uh, exercise 1 2 and 3 from the algebra 1 chapter and now we have to start with exercise 4 and uh, i'll take you to the screen uh, in fact we are on the screen so i'll start with the very first question question number 1 is minus 7 plus or minus 3 now this is a, a mixed exercise sort of so i'll be fast in my explanation because all these things we have done in the previous exercise okay so minus 7 Plus into minus is minus, so it will be minus seven minus three because these are two directed number with opposite sign. I'll put the minus sign, and I'll add seven and three. It will be minus ten. Question number two, minus six minus a minus seven. This will be minus six plus seven. When I remove the bracket, you know, I'll multiply this minus and minus, so it will be plus seven. Now these are two directed number with opposite sign, so I'll take the sign of the bigger number that is seven. So I'll take plus as the sign, and I'll subtract smaller number from the bigger number. So answer will be plus one. Third one is minus four multiplied by a minus three. This will be minus into minus is a plus, and four into three is twelve, so plus twelve. Fourth one, it is minus four multiplied by a plus seven. This will work out to minus into plus is a minus seven into four is a twenty-eight, so minus twenty-eight. Fifth one is four minus plus six. This will work out to four minus six. Now this is plus four minus six. So these are two directed number with opposite signs. So I'll take the bigger sign minus and I'll subtract the smaller from the bigger number. That will give me minus two as the answer. Sixth, it's a minus four multiplied by a minus four. This will be minus into minus will be plus, and four into four will be sixteen. So plus sixteen is the answer. Seventh, it is plus sixteen divided by a minus two. So plus divided by a minus will be a minus, and sixteen divided by two will be eight. So minus eight has to be the answer. So seventh ka answer is. Uh, minus eight. Uh, seventh ka answer is minus three. Okay. Exercise four. Seventh ka answer is minus three behind the book. So there is some uh, mistake over here. Okay. Seventh is six. Okay, this is not sixteen. This is plus six. Okay. So I made a mistake here. This should be. Plus six, okay. Plus six, okay. So plus divided by minus is a minus, and six divided by two should be three. So instead of eight, there should be a three over here. So minus three should be the answer, and that's correct. Okay. Coming to the next question, that is eighth one. Eighth one is a plus eight, and then minus a minus six. So the answer will be eight plus eight minus into minus is plus, so plus six. Now eight plus six will be fourteen, so plus fourteen is the answer. Going for the ninth one, minus seven multiplied by a plus four. This will be minus into plus is a minus, and seven into four is twenty-eight, so minus twenty-eight is the answer. Tenth one is, uh, it's a minus eight. Uh, divided by a minus two, fine. So minus divided by a minus is a plus, and eight divided by two is four. So plus four is the answer. Eleventh, it's a plus ten divided by a minus sixty. So plus divided by a minus will be a minus, and ten divided by sixty will be one by six. So this is the answer. Twelfth. Twelfth is minus uh, three square. Okay, now minus square will be plus, and three square will be nine. So answer should be plus nine. Thirteenth, forty minus 
plus 70. This will work out to 40 minus 70 plus 40 minus 70. This will work out to a minus 30. Okay. Now 14th. 14th is a minus 6 multiplied by a minus 4. Minus into minus is plus and 6 into 4 is 24. So plus 24 is the answer. 15th. Minus 1 whole raised to 5. Now whenever you have minus 1 raised to some odd number, your answer should always be a minus 1. And if it is minus 1 to raised to some even number, then the answer will be plus 1. Remember that. 16th. 16th is uh, minus 8 divided by a plus 4. Right? So minus divided by a plus is a minus and 8 divided by 4 is 2. So minus 2 has to be the answer. 17th. It is plus 10 multiplied by a minus 3. So this will be plus into minus is minus and 10 into 3 is 30. So minus 30 should be the answer. Okay. So 17 question we have completed. So let us make some space and uh, yeah, here we are. Okay. So 17 questions have been completed. Let us go for the 18th one. So 18th one is uh, it's a minus 7 multiplied by a minus 1. So minus into minus will be a plus 7 into 1 is 7. So plus 7 is the answer. 19th. 19th is a plus 10 and it's a plus minus 7. This will be plus 10 plus into minus is minus. So plus 10 minus 7 which is nothing but plus 3. Then 20. 20 is a plus 12 minus a minus 4. This will be plus 12 plus 4 which is a plus 16. 21. It's plus 100 plus a minus 7. This will be plus 100 minus a 7. This will be equal to uh, 93. Okay. Plus 93. Then 22. It's a minus 60 multiplied by a minus 40. So minus into minus will be plus and 60 into 40 will be 6 4s are 24 and then 2 zeros. 23. It's a minus 20 and uh, is it division or uh, okay let us say it is division and then minus 2 okay. Now minus divided by a minus will be plus and 20 divided by 2 should be 10. So plus 10 is the answer for 23rd. Let me check the answer for 23rd. And uh, 23rd is, uh, yeah, plus 10 is the answer. So correct, yeah. And the 24th one is minus 1 raised to a 20. As I told you, minus 1 raised to an even number will always be a plus 1. So here we complete all the 24 questions from this exercise 4. Not all the 24 questions. We have total 50 questions. So there are some more uh, around 50% we have completed. So rest of the questions we will be doing in the next video. So that's all for today. So bye, take care.